a review a first impressions tutorial demo thingy video <laughs> on the new MAC Ariana Grande Viva Glam products. I'm a big lover of the Viva Glam gla gla <laughs> Glam Sounds like a Pokemon. Glam to the rescue! So I jumped on this as soon as they came out. I haven't tried any of them on my lips. Usually when I get them I'm like mm, right away. But I wanted to do this video for you guys because I know so many of you guys love Ariana Grande as do I. Okay, so there were two items in this collection. The first one is a lip glass, and then the second one is a lipstick. The lipstick and the lip glass are both called Viva Glam Ariana Grande. All of the Viva Glam packaging have the signatures in red across. I love purchasing the Viva Glam collection, no matter who it is, mainly because they do celebs that I love so much. Every cent of the selling price goes to helping men, women, and children living with HIV and AIDS. That really is inspiring to me and I love to help in, in even in little ways like that. Lip gloss first. They are lip glass and I'll show you guys what it looks like. It is stunning. I feel like this is what I would do if I came out with a matte collection because I want like a dark lipstick but I also want like a sparkly lip gloss that's like nudie so this is so right up my alley. Alley? <laughs> it's like a almost like a rose gold and it has a ton of like gold reflex sparkles in there again they have their signature right across the tube and when you open it up um they have their signature vanilla scent that's phenomenal and will never get old for me it's beautiful and it's a little sponge tip applicator um let's go ahead and apply this to the lips and see what it looks like goes on very smooth. All MAC lip glasses are a little bit sticky. They have that stick in them, so if that's not something you like, then I wouldn't suggest MAC lipsticks. I personally love that, because I feel like it is secure kind of all day. It's like crazy shine, and like look at that. It like catches all the light in all directions, and you can see the sparkle in there. I love it. This will go over kind of like any color of lipstick, or if you just want to wear it on its own. Beautiful, yes, Ari. Let's move on to the lipstick. Okay, now if you guys haven't seen this collection yet, this may, like, may, maybe will shock you. I was like, oh my god, when I saw the color, I needed it. So the lipstick packaging looks like that. It's basically every other Viva Glam, the black and the red, and then her signature is across it. And dun dun dun, dun it is like a dark purpley, really reminds me of like vampire, like if you're doing a vampire tutorial, yes girl. I'm pumped for this because I have been in the market for a dark lipstick and then when I saw this one was gonna be launched, I'm like, oh my god, is this gonna be perfect for me? Because I really wanna try one. I don't know if I'm gonna like it, but let's try. I'm probably gonna need a lip liner. Oh well, we're just gonna try it on its own to get the real effect of just the lipstick. But I think that this will um, flourish if you do have a lip liner because it is so dark, but we're gonna try to be careful. <laughs> So I love the color, but it's really hard to get this even without lip liner. And I was trying to look at my collection. I don't really have a good, like, purpley dark color. So I'm going to use this one. And this one is by Essence, I believe. And it's in Mulberry. I'm just going to line my lips and then go. Okay, so it's definitely not perfect. I'm not that great at doing makeup, but I try, and I think I pulled it off well for doing like a, my very first like dark, dark lip. I love this color. It makes my teeth look really white. <coughs> I should have put the lip liner on before, but I didn't think it would look like as bad without the lip liner, but that's what I will do next time is put on that lip liner. Bring it in a bit, fill my lips with the lip liner, then put this over top. That's what I will do. Um, but other than that, I really enjoy the color. It's nice and like vibrant. It, it says it's a matte, but it is like pretty shiny for a matte. I love it though. It's mysterious. I feel like I need to wear a mask with this and be like, 
Rawr. And finally, I'm gonna apply some of this lip gloss over top of the lipstick. Um, I'm not gonna apply it directly from the tube though because I don't want my sponge to turn like a dark, weird color. So I am gonna use a lip brush. Super shiny and glossy now. I love it. I just wish I would have done a little bit better with being neat, but I mean, it still looks good. So thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope you guys all have a great day. I love this lip color. I hope you guys love this and let me know what other videos you want me to do. I love you all so much and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye cuties.